yeah so hello everyone welcome to today's video uh, this is shanmagaraj we are continuing our journey on standard of program management as part of pmi series essentially we are going to discuss about benefit sensation as part of the program management Uh, a program benefits management is that is a performance demand that defines create maximizes and delivers the the benefits provided by the program so that is where we do the program benefits management we already discussed benefit identification analysis and planning and delivery so today we're going to discuss about benefit transition All right so what is the purpose of the benefits transition the purpose is to ensure that the program benefits are transitioned to operational areas that can be sustained right so you know that there's a program is it's a set of components which include projects sub programs and operations meet together so as part of your transition where right, you will be completing your program and moving that to support program production support or something is very operational in nature but that's where the the benefits sustainment and actual benefits are getting realized in long term right so that is called the benefit transition so you want to ensure that how to monitor it how to evaluate it that's very important right so verifying that integration transition and closure of the program and its component meet or exceed the benefit realization criteria so you might have set some criteria in the planning phase and you want to verify that it is are we meeting that you need to develop a transition plan as a program manager to facilitate the ongoing realization of the benefits and tend over to the impact for operational areas so you need to have a transition plan so that it goes to another program or other you know other organization right so people should know what are things are coming in their way and how do we handle it as a thing so the receiver could be you know a product support organization service management you know support organization custom organization uh, transferring risk to and receiving you know you also transfer the risk to the receiving organization so as a program manager you need to ensure that you know whatever the Uh, the risk that is you know not not mitigated this is still you know relevant to the program this has been transitioned to organization right so in operations you should tell them right this is the risk and you have to hand over correctly right so and another set of activities in mode of evaluation of the program and program component performance against kpis and acceptance criteria so this is one of the things you do that before you transition to the operations so you, you, you give them what are the kpis and what is the current performance what was acceptance criteria what are things to be doing sustaining it right and review and evaluation of the acceptance criteria right that you have to do that if you want any change in the acceptance criteria you have to do that review of operational and program process documentation review of you know, training and maintenance materials all these things should go to operation guys review of applicable and the contractual agreements if any right so if it all building are going for a new agreement you need to go for that you want to review you want to change the terms for that right a few other activities include you know the assessment to determine if the resulting changes have been successfully integrated activities later to improving the acceptance of resulting changes right you need to you know the way you want to sustain and transition everything right? giving them that you know these are the areas you need to improve on it these are the activities you need to do workshops and meetings and trainings etc the transfer of risk affecting the benefits transition to the receiving organizations very very important activity as a program manager you have to transfer the risk to the you know the person who is receiving and the team is receiving a right so organization that is receiving right make them ready for it ready is an assessment and approval by receiving person right that's very important they have to assess you are things and approve it that they are taking it they are taking over from you and the disposition of the all related resources either you know you, you can dissolve your resources in the program and you can uh, some you can move some of the resources to the support and operations so all those dispositions can be done so these are activities you know involved in benefit transition to summarize you consolidate the coordinated benefits and transfer the ongoing responsibility right it's about transferring the program to operation transferring the responsibility transfer the risk disposing the all resources and everything right so that's about a summary of the benefit transition 
so with that we have come to the conclusion of today's video hope you got a fair idea about you know, what is benefit sensation what is the role of a program managing benefit sensation and what are the uh, typical activities you know, involved in this benefit sensation okay so thanks for your time take care and let me know if any any improvement areas i would like to you know, incorporate it thank you Bye -bye.